All right, welcome to day 39. We're getting into wintry days. It was a cold week, so I had to fiddle with the leg strap a lot this week because, uh, yeah, it was cold, so I was wearing long pants. Let's get warmed up. I like that there's different intros like that. Yeah, uh, this was Monday the 3rd, Tuesday the 4th, and I believe Friday the 7th? I can't remember if it was Thursday or Friday, but I did do Monday, Tuesday. Uh, but yeah, that's three days I got in this week. Uh, it was a good week, though... At the time of finally recording this, uh, it has not been a good week for further exercise because this is Tuesday. I'm late on recording this, uh, and I've not exercised at all this week. But Tuesday, I have I have an excuse because I've been busy today and I have more stuff to do. So I figure give myself the day off. Yesterday, I was feeling sore, so I didn't want to push it. And I'm glad I didn't because today, again, I'm busy, so I didn't want to overstimulate. But hopefully Thursday and Friday I can get a proper day of exercise and no soreness or anything. Yeah, uh... This week... Mmm, that... Mmm. Sorry, something about the audio. I don't know why. Ring Fit does not like being recorded. For some reason. I don't know why. Tears of Solar Plexia. Uh, other than... Other than just progress, there's not really generally anything to talk about for this week. We're starting with bank balance. I'm just gonna skip ahead. Actually, no, I'm not gonna skip ahead, like, because I, I should show it off and like, hey, I'm doing stuff. It's when I'm doing it multiple times. I s I'm glad that the tutorial does tell you after you've been away long, but this one's so simple, I don't think I needed the tutorial. Also, for some reason, it felt like... Like, I was swear I was holding it straight. And yet it was like, oh, I'm tilted to the left. Like, no, I'm I'm holding it perfectly straight on my abs. Why is it Why is it tilting like that? I don't know. Slight imperfections in the technology or something. I don't know how I missed that coin. That was impressive how I missed that one. I don't know, it's just bank balance and it made for a good warm-up just because of how simple and easy it is, at the very least. It was not a good score. Like, it's a good thing I already have the perfect on this, so I'm not too worried about any of that, but... Shut up, Ring. Wh what else am I supposed to press in with? Don't just press in with your arms. But wh what else is there to push in with? My hands? But that's my arms, I assume. Do you mean push in with my abs? But uh, that's not how that works. That's not how that works! Whoa. Yeah, I only went this way just for rewards, quick rewards. Mustard Skeleton. Am I going to grab? I guess I think I am. Yeah, I guess I am just doing the the side quests now. I I go into the store to see. Oh, do you have to buy? Can I buy this stuff? 
But no, I have to go collect it, because I don't have enough to craft it. I'm just going to skip ahead past all this. Okay, so now we're actually getting back into the next level. I went to make sure, should I? Should I? Oh yeah, I made some smoothies just to... I figure if I'm going to need to get crests for making smoothies, might as well double the amount of crests I get. And since I could make four, I made four. Even though I'm not going to be using all four for any time soon. But, you know, I have them now. Finished. I wanted to use it pre-getting into the level just so that I could get it in. But now you have to actually get into the level before you can use it. Unfortunately. Oh, starting right off with stairs. We got stairs. And then we got the overhead arm bend thing. Overhand ring pull. I'm glad they, they, they are starting to actually, like, bring back gimmicks more. And not just, oh, it's in one level and then that's it. Like, I want to see them do more, just mix them all in, give you more variety. Like, they, they do, like, start, with these stages, they do seem capable, like... I don't know, just, they're adding more stuff in slowly, and it does feel capable of being varied and not getting tiring. I still don't know what the boy we're carrying something heavy. Yes. Yes. I'm I'm is that just for the the beginning spot cuz the hold putting behind me I'm not doing that with something heavy. What are you talking about? That's dangerous. That sounds extremely dangerous. You know, otherwise, uh... Okay, let's switch sides. No, it, it, it's... This is still the probably, like, the easiest of the exercises in my repertoire. I think I was fixing my leg strap for that. It was too far down, so it was getting my hand in the way. Or something. No, this this exercise is probably the easiest of the ones I'm dealing with. Okay. The other, I mean, some of the other ones are like. What am What am I trying to say? I, I did have a point there that wasn't just, oh, yeah, you just, I don't know. Also, I'm surprised that, oh, wait, no, I, I'm surprised that I didn't kill the megaphone that turn. Just because I was like, oh, wow. So that's how much health they do have. Because I, I figured with how overleveled I am and all that. Nah, it would have died. Okay, so Warrior 3 post, though. I do feel like I'm getting better at it. Like, I... I, I don't know. Do I, I don't know if I want to give up on that one just because... You know, it will actually get me to understand balance. It will it's going to develop my balance. And giving up on it is just going to keep me at having no balance at all. 
Whereas if I keep trying, I can maybe develop some amount of balance that I definitely do not have and will not have for quite a while. Like, like maybe, maybe it's worth, is it worth it? I, uh... Like, I do, I do want to be able to, like, be balanced. Like, balance has just general life use of being able to balance stuff is useful. Being able to have a good balance for yourself is useful. It's not just, oh, this is, it's not like a parlor trick or, or anything like that. And it's not just within exercise I'm getting benefit out of it. As a general life thing, I'm getting benefits out of it. So, maybe I really should just go all in on not just that one post, because there's other posts that are going to be... Also, apple cider vinegar is ACV. But, uh... You know, it... It's, it's hard to justify it either direction. Like, my balance is terrible, so I shouldn't even bother with these exercises because they're not going to be working correctly. But if I keep going with them, maybe I will develop balance and be able to do them correctly, and that's the point of them. Oh, so I don't know how I pulled in there when trying to shoot that box. But, uh, like, through the just trying to get enough reps for... Oh god, I hate mountain climbing still so much. Enough reps just for the title. I have gotten better at doing it. Even if I'm still falling over sometimes. Like, is it already working, or was that just a good day? I don't know how sometimes it's a good and not a great. Also, four hits, and that's the first actual damage I took. The two frogs did nothing. Like, I barely took two hearts of damage from four attacks. And am, I, am I just that overpowered at the moment? And then this, I, I am regretting lack of AoE skills, but it just forces me to actually try and plan some attacks of, okay, I split the room, which room, which side do I take out first? So I figure, get rid of the yellow guy first because he has a lot of health and I can probably easily kill him with not the full move just because this isn't... I figure, don't do the full move, cause... Uh, this is one- I'm- this might actually be the easiest move I have, not the- Not the red one, this is the easiest one. The pendulum bend. Just cause it- Maybe I'm not bending correctly, or too much, or too little, I don't know. Cause I can't, like, look at myself of how I'm bending. Yeah, uh... Yeah, and I didn't think I'd be able to kill the Puffer Squish anytime soon, so I figure... 
get rid of two enemies instead of just one, even if one of the enemies was super weak and basically pointless. Like, I'm pretty sure this one specifically was, like, the best one I did. It's still very rough, as you can see. Very inconsistent timing. The speed's all over the place. But it was better than what I've d done up to now. I'm, I really am torn. I'm really torn on whether or not I should. I think ultimately the correct choice is to just keep going with it. Even if I don't want to. Also, I only did this just because I wanted to do the healing skill if yeah, if just for the title because Again, I'm so overpowered. I'm never I'm not like never using these. I kill before I need to heal most of the time. And this gave me an excuse to use a healing skill one time. Even though I think this is the last battle of this stage that... Yeah, looking at how much time is left in this clip, uh, there's eight minutes left, so... Taking out, like, three minutes for outro, that's, like, five minutes left. Which, there's still a minute or so left in this fight alone between this move and the killing blow. And also the counterattack. Then I have to run to the exit... Do all the exiting stuff. Yeah, that's... Like, I... I don't use the healing skills. And there's so many of them. If I could do damage with them, sure, I'd bring them back. I'd bring them in more. But I... I don't need the healing. Leg raise, I start... I doing this just because I figure... It'll end also be before I get the full thing. And I get halfway through it anyway. Yeah, halfway through. Great job. Go drink some water. You know, and now it's just run to the end. Yeah, I That is the big like problem with me being so overleveled, and I just keep getting stronger and stronger. Now turn your exercise into experience points. I was like, <sighs> I don't know. There's a lot of things that I'm thinking of that's. Lightly cover the IR motion camera with the pad of your right thumb as shown. Measuring. Please do not move your thumb. Like, maybe I should just take more turns to just waste time and heal, even when I don't. Just to say that I did the exercise. Just because they're kind of worth doing.
But now I have the crest so I can actually do that side quest now. So I'm gonna just do it. I only made the one just because I only need the one. And as we saw, I don't really need healing. Also, I decided to go full on Mustard Skeleton just for the full stats because, I mean, why not? And not further, why not, like... Like, it doesn't really matter? I mean... My bonus was just easier running, which you can tell the next running stage I do. You can tell the difference of how much slower I run. Oh. Yay! Item that I'll never need or use! And this challenge I will do next time. Oh wait, no. Do I do this first? We showed this last time, so I'm just going to skip ahead. Yeah, 20,000 points even for only having 30 seconds. That's really good. Like, that's a really good score for how short a time I had. Game gym is open, yeah. And now we call it an end. And even the game saying, you should end this now. You know, review, this week's review was, I should get a lot more aerobic exercise than I'm getting. I should do that more, I should run more. But uh, I, this was, this was good for me to think on before going into the Thursday and Friday exercises of how I should handle the future. Alright, day 39! Day, or is this day 40? I don't even, I'm pretty sure this is day 40, yeah? Yeah, this is 40. This is day 40, part 1. Yep, there it is, day 40. Oh, wow, we got through that already. I wasn't even paying attention. But, uh... Yeah, we're still in... We're still in the, the, the rainy season. But now we're getting a boss fight. Like, oh, we had no idea that it was him. I, I, yeah, no, no idea. Absolutely no clue. <laughs> I, I knew it immediately. It was really obvious. Yeah. It's a shower time. That's weird. Oh no, did did it desync? I think the audio slightly desynced. No. Oh, this okay. That it didn't desync, but I have to skip ahead. Okay, so I had to skip ahead because uh, you may have noticed I was going through those dialogue boxes rather slow at, a, like, a weird place, a uh, pace. I got a phone call, so I spent, like, 20 minutes in a phone call before I finally got back to... Actually, I think it was, like, 40 minutes, so... I just had 20 minutes of recording thinking, oh, this will be a quick phone call. 20 minutes later, I'm still on call. But anyway... Abdenus, we finally get to actually fight him. And we get a very, very close up on his chest. I did like, I do like that, like that shirt, that like, well, shirt, that shirt flick. What is that even supposed to be? I don't know. I figured, you know what, let's up our attack power. I'm not going to use these really anywhere else anyway, so... Okay, let's go. Breathe in when you 
lower your leg. Me? Great! Good job! I, it's, it's a good excuse to do the leg raise and all that, uh... Okay. I do like his animations and his, like, entire being for this boss fight. He just seems really chill, even though he's like, yes, he's he's taken over by the dark power and all that. Uh, he's like, yeah, he just, he seems so chill. Even when he's your enemy, he's like, yep, nope. I'm, I'm just here. I'm just doing as I'm needed. Also, there's one of my free turns. So this boss just gets absolutely destroyed with no, once again, no need to heal because I'm just speeding through it because big attacks, big damage, big defense. And he's not even getting turns. The skill system just, are, you're already super strong, but then you add in the skill system and you get, or the, the, the like the, the skill tree, and you just get so much stronger. Otherwise, it's just doing more of the same. Pendulum Ben's easy. The torso lift, I do think the got a little bit better. Easier to do, but it's still really on the core. And then I actually I think this is the best warrior three I did all week is during the boss fight. Slowly return to the starting position. Be sure to keep your elbows above your ears. Okay, I I do love his sound effects. Yeah, I, that one did go a lot smoother. I can't remember if this side also went smooth or not, but you can tell, like, the speed's better. And I am only doing the tilts with, uh, if I am on one leg. If I fall back onto one leg, yes, I do try to get back into position, and I don't start doing the movements intentionally without moving, taking it off. A good omen! You haven't even damaged me yet! What good omen is there? I just got three turns in a row. Okay, let's go. More leg raises to really make myself feel awful in my abs. I don't think it's going to be like doing anything like I'm not going to get Abdomus level hips like any time ever. But you know, it does. It is giving me a little something of an effect, I think. Also, uh, that that one there, for some reason, it wasn't properly, properly registering my up and down. You're a sculpted six-pack! And then he's just already sitting down on the ground like, Oh, this is how I chisel through! I sit down! <laughs> look, at, look at his moves. Look at his moves. Look, look, look at that dance. 
He's doing a little dance. Look at him jiggle. Everybody likes to jiggle. I'm Jiggle Billy. Optimus was Jiggle Billy in another life. And then look at that. He's so low on health. Just in time for my yellow to go back to normal. But look at his health. He's so close. I think I did this just because I didn't want to just only do yellow. It would have been fine if I had just done only yellow, but... I figured, do something different. I mean, there was also that one balance move I did, but... Variety is good, and... I ran out of, uh... I ran out of the smoothie. So I might as well. I don't think it kills him, though. Why did I take so long to get into this position? I think it wasn't registering me in the position, so I had to, like, move my arm around a bunch just to get to register that one. That was a longer pause than it should have been. And, like, oh my gosh, I'm doing so much less damage when I'm not using super powerful yellow. Now he's just barely going to live... If I had used the yellow skill, he definitely would have died. That yellow smoothie did actually matter, I'm pretty sure. If I had exploited his weakness. or And not used tricep kickback. So for once, I do think the smoothie made a difference. For once. Usually it doesn't, though. I I only did mountain climber just for an extra rep or two. I figure it's gonna instant he's gonna instantly die, so might as well. And I vastly overestimated it, or underestimated his health. I did not want to be going for that long. I just wanted to get it done. Great job. Go drink some water. I mean, you were shaking your straight up abdominals pretty far, uh, Abdomus, with that little dance you did. Exercise into experience points with a victory pose. Charge your squat power, but don't overextend yourself. Real victory! Lightly cover the IR motion. The IR motion camera. Your right thumb, as shown. Measuring. Please do not move your thumb. <laughs> yeah. We beat Drago how many times already, and yet we're no match for him? I don't think... I don't think anyone in this world understands what standing a chance means. Like, <laughs> we beat him so many times, what? Also, just randomly free chest there. Thanks for... Thanks for the extra skill. And it's just a straight upgrade by 5 damage. Or 5 attack power. I guess I w I'm pretty sure I was feeling it after, after that boss fight. But I figure I barely did that much today. I should do more. I should. And so I just, I just kept going then. 
So do the battle gym and it's four rounds because four rounds for some reason. One red bulldog and if only that was a super powerful red move. Maybe I should have did it, but instead I did ring race combo because one enemy might as well do full damage. I wasn't thinking of which exercise should I do most. What exercise makes the most sense right about now? I'm pretty sure this was just planning for the next round instead playing the game instead of the exercise. Yeah, it didn't even kill it. It's like, maybe I should have did the red move? I don't know if that would have killed it. Honestly, don't know. Warrior 3 is just, again, because I should do it. I need, I need the reps for the title, and... Oh, God. In the course of a week, I turned my opinion around on it completely of... I should just keep doing this for the practice and the balance building. Ah, it's so... So back and forth in me mentally. And it will help me physically and... It's worth it. It's gotta be worth it, right? Right? Please tell me it's worth it. I, and I think actually this one, the tricep kickback. Uh, I don't think I like it anymore. Like it's it's there. Like having consistent opinions on this stuff is hard, just because. Oh, there are ben there's the benefits, and then there's the the negatives and the how hard it is how easy it is keep it up and I like the, especially when it gets to the speedy part, it's like I am still extending all the way, but it just doesn't do anything at that point because it's not any it when at least for me it doesn't feel like it's doing anything when it's the fast compared to the slowness. Also, I don't know if I'm doing this one right, but it's like look at look at that jiggle, look look at that look at them bounces, look at them bounce, look at that bounce. And look at that damage, that was like so much. Cross your legs firmly. And that was this the first one of this? Uh leg scissors is very hard. Yeah, this is the first one. Why, why is he going Uno Dos, not One Two? Is this like a does this like exercise originate in like Spanish speaking territories or something? I don't know the etymology of exercise. It's all just the same to me. 
This is it's whatever gets you fit. So it's like, it's like is that is that why? Also, the leg raise is just because it's low on health. Oh no, I changed my mind. Hinge post just because I haven't done it in a while. The final round is a lot of enemies of different colors. Well, four enemies, but... I figure Mountain Climber just to test the water, see what I can get rid of in one turn. I think because it's colored, the Naughty List gets destroyed immediately. Okay, no, the Matter Ray gets destroyed first. Then the Naughty List. And then the other two remain. I, oh, I hate Mountain Climber. Like, I've gotten better at it, but I still hate it. I, I That's definitely the one that I've decided, like, fully. I'm getting rid of it when I can. There's better exercises to do for that. But I do, but I gotta push it. There's two enemies left. Do I do, yeah, I just do try to kick back just cuz. Even though again, it's, it is probably the one that's like my least more mountain climber. God, yes, yes. I think that's part of the big challenge with exercises, finding which exercises are right for you. I'm trying to reminisce and like think about what all are the exercises I feel are perfect for me in each of the different subsets and I can't think of anything off the top of my head of like that's the best one that's giving me a challenge also this expansion uh, giving me a challenge but also I don't hate doing also finally another max heart because like it's that's why I keep wanting to sl get stuff in and out. Just so that I'm not doing the same stuff over and I'm finding different things I like or do not like. I am done, but I do want to go back in through the portal. And then I want to look at the new... Like, look at how big that is now! We used just to have that middle square and now we have this whole thing that's all over the place and there's level 2 skills in here. That's nearly 700 attack- or yes, yeah, 700. 300 attack power. This is 300 attack power almost. Like, wow! So I buy it. Because that's going to just destroy any enemy. Like, it's just an outright upgrade. Just, 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 upgrades. It's better than Ring Ray's combo by nearly double. Has the same recharge, same range. It's just, wow. It's, it really is just that insane to me. That it's that strong. And we'll see it next up, next uh, day, day 41. There's a lot of smoothies to get in here. 
Day 41, we'll see it in action. It's like, holy crap. That's strong for no reason. Why is that strong? Why? Level t is there a level 3? I don't even know yet. It might expand later. Also, I got a lot of titles through this one. Yeah, that's... Yeah, this is the retrospective week. And, like, thinking of the future. And yeah, no, that's, that's it for this day. Day 41, that Thursday or Friday, I do not remember. Probably was Friday. Thanks for asking me if I'm feeling sore. I was not. Mention something. It can take a lot out of you. Yes, it can. Especially when it's new stuff that's hard to do. It really ties you out. Also, nice knee lift there. Tip. I believe I do both the top... And... Yeah, I do both the top and bottom pathways just to open up every level pathway and just get it all done. You know, I don't remember what I was even thinking of there. I, I figure... Because the running involved, I should do the actual level first. But you can see me running my my awesome skeleton wear that I beat up a like a god in, even though he's not a god, he's a one of the four masters. Like like look how much slower I'm going. You can tell it's going just slower. Yes, I did. Also, I'm glad I didn't use a sesame smoothie for this level, because I miss a bunch of the items along the way. And I hate that it's this level. I hate the stupid rowing still, always and forever. Now, this is a break from the running. Like, you get the first battle early. I have two yellows in there. And his leg scissors. Uh, I didn't properly mention how I feel about this one because I was confused by the Uno, Dos, Uno, Dos from uh, Ring. So I was like confused. Uh, it's hard. I don't know why that one didn't register correctly, but. Yeah, no, this. This is hard. It's really fast. Like, they expect you to go at really fast pace. And you're not allowed to put your legs down there in the air the whole time. It really works you. It's... Oh, my God. I do wonder if that if that one... I think it wouldn't have died anyway. If that was a great instead of a good. It's not that much more damage. I was like, oh, my God. We got power up, or defense up. And attack up. Which is interesting that having two there does make them give different buffs. And mountain climber again, just to do it. I should do it even though I hate it as much. I don't need to do it anymore for a title, but I should. It's blue. And it's AoE, so make sure I kill off this enemy. Well done. And more running! 
And it's going so slow. I feel so... I got so used to the other armor. I lost so much. It's... Oh my... And also this. Still... I've gotten better at it now that I'm more exercised, I think. And like more understanding of positions, I think. It's easier for me. I still don't like it. You know, I got so used to the other armor set that the fact that I'm going so slow now really was throwing me off. But I like really, I, I was trying to aim to the right there and it aimed forward. So I had to try and reset. That was upsetting that I missed that box. Hopefully that wasn't the EXP one. Hopefully that was just a couple uh, currency, which I have way more than enough of. And once again, I try to do this jump. Doesn't work out. You need the upgrade, whatever the upgrade is. When am I going to get that? Is it going to be after I beat uh, Guru? I'm, I'm guessing it's after I beat Guru and Ma. I will get the fourth power back. So I have to get through world 10. There's one of the items I missed. I didn't even bother with those hearts. Though I wanted to grab them, I just missed. I also didn't even notice that they were there because my eyes were not like focused on them. They were blending in with like the colors of the foliage. Too, but it's like I wanted to grab them. Now, uh, that's my thing is that's what I'm thinking is for the other paths that I can't get to. I need to get through Guru Ranma. I'm trying to decide, do I go for just getting rid of three or do I mountain climber? Even though I don't want a mountain climber. Oh god, I'm gonna mountain climber. I hate it. And it just barely lives. Like, oh my god, I should have... Oh, wait. I forgot this happened. It's kind of rude that it's only a single enemy and not all of them. Like, it's nice that I'm going to be able to get rid of the enemy. But like it's why didn't wasn't it all three enemy? Oh wait, it, it, I didn't even kill the enemy. I didn't even kill the enemy, so that was pointless almost. No, I I what 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 was I on before? No, I I hate mountain climbing. That's I think that's what I was just on a tirade about that over anything. Too much focusing on the game. Well, I guess it did help because it lowered it and negated the matter race healing. Because it was going to heal someone. So I at least negated that heal on something else that would have made me take an extra turn. So it, it, that did help. Not greatly, but it helped. And I'm pretty sure this does end up killing them, so yeah, it did help. It did help. But uh, now from the first exercise itself, it's 
Same old, same old. There's not much more that I can say on that at this point. It's just trying to just get it done at that point, at this point. Though, again, I do like how, like, even though the level theme is, or the level layout is the same, the fact that they made it all, like, cold and rainy looking, that does give a bit more... I lost my train of thought there. Yeah, you know, it's the the rain, the rain. Yeah, it at least gives you some variety, even with it being the same exact level layout. Like obviously, it it, it is just all straight lines essentially. You don't do the turns yourself. The character does the turns for you. So it is all, but again, it's how everything looks and the little gimmicks in between. The looks of it matters so much for an enjoyment factor. You don't just have, yes, a straight line, the roads curve and all that. into experience points with a victory pose. Wait, did I accidentally skip ahead somehow? Cuz that No, yeah, no that. That was the end. Yeah, that was Lightly cover the IR. That just seemed like all of a sudden like it ended out of nowhere and it just threw me off. Measuring. Please do not move your thumb. I, but, uh, I also kind of use the, blah, 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 blah. I kind of skip past talking about other stuff. Uh, I did finally use the leg, the leg press again with the 295 power and it's just as strong as you would think it would be doing over a thousand damage even without abusing color. And it's like, holy crap. Also, Hoplin, really? You're there just for, to make me use AOE. Uh, Trace of Kipkak. I, I kept doing it just because it seemed like arms, okay, arms are helpful. Excellent. It's good to do arms. Well done. And I, I think they weren't tired yet. Is why I was doing it. Like, while the rest of my body was starting to get... I was getting more tired with ev all the rest of my body, but... And, like, in general. But my arms, this doesn't... I don't know. Yeah, it, 
I think, yeah, that's... I'm gonna... I might actually just go back to my previous red skill and, like, take the damage loss just to get the variety back in and get, like, something that I feel is challenging to me and, like, actually working my arms. Oh, so this is like, look how much damage it's doing! Look how much the Cypress is doing! Like, you can feel that 300 power, that upgrade! Like, you're already doing so much damage, and like, I'm so strong compared to everything! Now I'm getting level 2 skills and doing so much damage! Like, what? It, it, it's just insane to me. Move super energetically. And again, more and more mountain climbing just for AoE and spreading out my exercises across the whole body. If they went, if they were all next to each other, I probably wouldn't have done the mountain climber, honestly, though. If they were, oh, wait, this. <sighs> right. I went, like, full focus on the gold hoplin, just because, yeah, I can kill the, the, the scuttle bell, but there's a gold hoplin. I need to kill that. And I, I did want to do, I did actually want to do the leg scissors here, just for the leg scissors itself, but like, it also let me kill the Scuttle Bell, and it makes sure it's not getting its attack in on me, which would probably actually do some damage, because it has the wind up, so that's actually going to be programmed to do a good amount of damage. But then... It just gets resummoned. You're actually meant to take out the megafauna as quick as you can, but there's a gold hoplin. And I think this this wasn't my best Warrior Three pose, but I do. Yeah, this is this is where I started to think like, yeah, maybe I should keep doing this. Maybe it's helping my balance. Maybe it's not something I should get rid of immediately. There should be a straight line to heal the head. Slowly return to the starting. Also, now it's raising its heart again. A tough one, but you can do it. Yeah, the the killing the Hoplin became the priority just because Gold Hoplin. Even if I already have a billion money, it seems to be the thing I should take care of. Like for any play, you just go do that. And that actually killed the round, or the, the section. But I could have probably gotten it done a lot faster if I just focused down the Megafauna. Like, did, did, uh, 
Warrior Pose 3 to the left, then do Mountain Climber. That probably would have did it in two turns. But then I wouldn't have gotten that gold, that goldie. Move super energetically. Left, right, left, right, left. You really feel this exercise in your upper body and core. Ten more. Right, left, right, left. Five more. This one though, this was definitely use. Use it, the mountain climber, just because four enemies, two of them got killed, almost killed the matter ray. Worth it. And Warrior 3 pose again, just cause... Yeah, do I... Do I pull the trigger like... This is where I'm thinking... Oh my god, I'm actually gonna keep doing it. Not just for the title, I'm gonna, I'm doing this one just for the balance itself, and... Like you can see, I'm doing pretty good on the smoothness. Okay. It's pretty smooth. Don't to oh god, yeah. And At least until I get tree pose, I need to just keep doing Warrior 3. I think it's actually helping. Like, this is... Why is it so strong? This is such an easy activity and then it's so strong. I don't get it. The game balance is so off. The exercise is good. Some of it is very quality, I would even say. Your sweat is so shiny and beautiful. I don't know. It's, the more I get into it, the more I see it's flawed. I, I can't help but be, especially when I'm doing these logs, I can't help but use a critical eye. Yeah, the, the critic in me just can't help but criticize. I'm... I've become a lot more critical of my game time over the years. You can tell just how much I hate Yuck as a 7 after how much I love the rest of the Yuck as a series of how critical I can be. But that's it for this week. Uh, next week, week 16 is going to be a short one, like I said, because Monday, Tuesday, no wing, ring fit. It's worth doing. Like, I am... I am getting the benefits. But I'm just seeing so many little things here and there of, okay, that's that's a problem, this could be better, that could be better. Stretch slowly and do your best not to bounce. Bring yourself back slowly. Bend your left knee and bring your ankle up behind you. Pull your knee backward and stretch the front of your thigh. Now do the same on the opposite side. Hold the top of your foot to stretch your shin muscles as well. Bring yourself back slowly. 
Widen your stance. Place your hands on your knees and drop your hips. Rotate your left shoulder uh. inward and extend your left hip joint. At the very least, after this is all said and done, after I finish the log, I'm still going to keep exercising is my big takeaway. I think that's really... together in front of you with your palms facing it's, out it's had a positive effect no matter how many flaws i find in it that's the thing is the methodology the like the encouragement is the very big important thing but there could be some better methodology with some things some better game design that's for sure stretch your upper arms while pulling uh -uh. It's hit and miss. It's but I, I'm I'm not definitely not just I'm not regretting it. I will not regret it. It's just been too good for me. That much is always going to be the case. Bring yourself back slowly, and your stretching is complete. Good job. That, yeah, as we can see from Super Size Me, that's not how that works. No, there was some methodology wrong with that one, and yeah. But yeah, that's, that's it. Uh, eh, no. The weeks go on. I get more critical of the game. But I'm still doing it, and we're getting closer and closer to the end. I'd say probably by week 22. Three, maybe? Dep uh, depends on how much I play each week. Week 23, we might finally see the end of it. But again, I don't know how many worlds there are to really give an actual estimate. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's it. I'm just, if I don't end it here, I'm just going to be tons of silence, ruminating on things. Take care, may the power of Anadid Hawks they waste to your gains.